All right, 1220 now and right on schedule. Snow is starting to pick up across southeastern Wisconsin from the southwest to the north. Soon our northern spots, you'll start to get your snow as well. So here's a look at the advisory map and uh, you have a winter weather advisory for the southwestern counties. Jefferson, Walworth, Racine and Kenosha until midnight tonight. For Milwaukee, Waukesha and points to the north until 2 a.m. But I got to say, I think this is wrapping up for everybody by 10 o'clock, besides maybe a little bit of drizzle. All right, currently in West Bend, we have a temperature of 27 degrees and currently in Milwaukee as well. You can see here we go. Marquette interchange. The snow is starting to fly. Just getting started here in Milwaukee. But look at the temperature. 37 degrees. That is super important because it's going to make accumulation tough. Even if we start to get some bursts of heavy snow, the snow is going to melt as it accumulates. So again, we're probably going to end up with just a slushy couple inches here in the city of Milwaukee. Temperatures inland, not nearly as warm. Look at Waukesha, 28 degrees, 28 in Watertown. This is the area that I think, you know, could end up with four inches or so of accumulation. So let's go through your weather headlines. Snow is on the way while well, it's arriving. Maybe more snow possible tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow night but a bigger storm system we're going to be watching as we head into the New Year's weekend. All right, Storm 4 Max radar. You can see how the snow is really starting to fill in now, especially south of Milwaukee. We're picking up these darker blues, but it's mainly blue. Maybe a little bit of rain mixing in right along the lakeshore now in Kenosha. And I do think as the afternoon goes on, we're going to see a little bit more rain mixing in right along the lakeshore. Now, as we look at the Storm 4 Max radar wider view here, you can see the snow extends through northern Illinois. Fairly compact, small area of snow lifting in from the southwest here, so it's only going to last until early this evening. So future forecast, probably the height of the snow around 3 o'clock or so. 3, 4 o'clock coming down pretty good. That strong east wind, again a big influence with snow amounts off of Lake Michigan. By 6 o'clock, Still some bands of snow, but notice how it tapers off shortly after and by 10 o'clock, according to future forecasts, we're done besides maybe a stray sprinkle out there overnight tonight. The skies clear out by tomorrow morning. We'll start off dry with sun tomorrow, but then tomorrow afternoon, the potential will be there for some light snow. This run of future forecast kind of holding off until the evening hours, but it does bring a band of light snow across parts of southeastern Wisconsin. Again, tomorrow's snow shouldn't add up to much, maybe an additional inch, but today, Maybe up to four inches across our inland spots. If you're within a few miles of the lake, you're probably going to see a slushy inch or two, maybe even less if you're right on the lake shore. Your forecast for today, 36 degrees for your daytime temperature, snow heavy at times, a mix lakeside for tonight, a low temperature of 30 degrees, one to two inches total in Milwaukee, as much as four inches inland over towards Waukesha. Here's your seven day on Wednesday. That chance of light snow in the afternoon, I don't think everybody's going to see it, but if you do land under that narrow band of snow, maybe you get another inch of snow tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. Now Thursday dry for everybody, 32. Friday, 35 degrees. New Year's Eve looks to be good. Saturday, New Year's Day, we're going to have to watch that one. That one has the makings of maybe being a pretty good winter storm. 27 Sunday and 27 on Monday. And we'll be right back.